Whatever you're getting at, get to it. If I had to blame for George's mistakes, shouldn't Miss White be held accountable for Bigby's actions as well? Like what? How about the way he treated poor Tweedle D when he was in your custody? That wasn't us. He was beaten to mashed apples while under your watch. Under no, we weren't. No, we didn't. He's right. That was Bluebeard, not me. Exactly. He was a murder suspect. Besides, Crane was still deputy mayor when that happened. Right before you decided to kidnap him. It was for his own protection. Oh, you're right, dear. Crane was in charge. Sometimes it's hard to tell the difference. That's enough. So, you won't answer for your employee's behavior, but I must perish for This mine. is completely different. I we did all... not order those two girls dead. It <coughs> simply never happened. Georgie killed Faith and Lily. End of story. They want to scapegoat me for their own tangled ends, but they refuse to answer for their own this crimes. This is right. Oh, please. This isn't the point. We'll deal with them after we deal with you. Listen, I the know... The laws apply when we need them. Everyone calm down. This isn't I the reason I mean, a certain we're level here. of privilege should be afforded to... to this is how it's always been. This is what I'm talking about. We lashed our ropes to this disease world. And ever since, which one of us has been there for you? Who filled your lives with the promise of more? Not you. Who was there while they idly played in their towers? Judging you. Treating you as mindless children, too stupid to command your own destiny. Without me, who will pay your rent when you're on the verge of eviction? All this who will be under your thumb. Challenge mm -hmm. their brutality when it leaks to our dear citizens. Again, not who us. Who will protect <laughs> you from the big bad wolf? Who will be the Bigby, Miss White. Excuse me. I... Dear. I wanted to make sure I had the chance to say something. Why don't you take a moment to catch your breath? If What's you she doing here? I'd like to... I, I need to say something. We're kind of in the middle of something. She has something to say and we're gonna listen. Go right ahead. You probably don't remember me. I don't know why I was afraid to come My here. Dear, I don't Just know shut up. You enslaved us for years. Let us hear stories about what you do. Told us we would lose everything if we stepped just one toe out of line. And we couldn't say a word about it because of these damn ribbons. But you know what? Now it's my turn to talk. How are you? I found Vivian's body. Did you kill her? Did he? Sheriff, this is highly irregular. Be quiet. We need to establish some order here. Vivian wanted you freed from the ribbon. Own life. I'm sorry, um, I don't think Nerissa. My name is Nerissa. It's okay, my dear. It's going to be just... He ordered them dead. This fucker. Faith and Lily. That's a lie. I was in the goddamn room when he did it. Faith and Lily are dead because of you. The only two people who ever gave a damn about me. And now I can finally say you're an asshole. And I hope you rot at the bottom of the witching well for what you did. And this just confirms it. He made Georgie do it. It was always him. Georgie would have <laughs> never done anything without his say-so. Ever. You're going to take the word of a stupid... At least five other girls will back me up on this. We all heard you say it. Mm -hmm. Did you now? Looks like we found our evidence. <laughs> first hand. He's guilty. Good enough for me? Yep. Me too. So that's it, right? Calm down the witching well. Nah, that's too fucking easy for a crook like that. What do you mean? He's gotta pay for what he did. Listen to yourselves. You're all rats, fleeing from one sinking ship to the next. So quick to latch onto whatever will keep your miserable lives afloat. This is how you want to repay all I've done for you. What, you take two people's lives away and now you want mercy? You know we can't let you go free after this. What did you expect to happen here? You're getting what you deserve. Well done, then. Now, for your sentence. We don't have to become murderers. What are you talking about? He's guilty. I know that, but we don't have to kill anybody. We can imprison him, lock him up forever, somewhere he can never hurt him. How can we be sure he won't escape? I can help. We'll use magic. 
That's not good you. enough. There will be more, more if he isn't stopped. Then we get rid of him. So dangerous. We can send him Everyone, away. listen up. Clearly, we're having trouble agreeing on a suitable punishment. So I think this we... This is going nowhere. Someone needs to make a decision. Who? I hope you aren't suggesting yourself. We should have a vote. Make it democratic. Do you really think that's going to work? He's right. Nobody can agree on anything. What about Bigby? What about him? He was appointed. He's the only official representative, really. <laughs> <laughs> that makes sense to me. Who fucked up is, our le is the legal system of fables, where sure? we are literally this the judge the and the law enforcement? Okay, <laughs> Mr. Wolf, it's your call. It's almost like a civil Just forfeiture case. Do what you think is right. I wonder what King Cole actually is. Yes, yeah, sure. No idea. Do what you think is right. Teach him a fucking lesson. What do you lesson. think? No. Uh, yes, uh, you can lock him just away. fucking get uh, rid of him. Lock him up? Not this way. Oh crap. Oh. <laughs> okay. I've had no one else moves. Yeah. Well, it is a pretty tense moment, so. You said you had a way to keep him from hurting people. Wait, you can't be What he's done? You're just gonna put him in prison? This isn't the way, Sheriff. You're doing the right thing. Yes, there's a way. All right, do it. So how many days has this thing pretty much been up for straight? <laughs> a lot. Let's just say that. Yeah. Maybe two weeks. I don't know when last time he slept. Not what I was expecting. <laughs> Man. <laughs> sharp tongue. I thought it would be better for everyone if he parted with it. Thanks, Greenleaf. <laughs> work is work, I guess. Hey, Sheriff. Are you gonna come see the truck off? We're leaving for the farm in a few. Thought you might want to. Well, I don't know. I'll be down in a minute. Okay. Great. <laughs> this fucking line. I'm not sure why Jack's there. <laughs> Desperate for work? Jack. Oh, uh, Mr. Wolf? Yeah. Flycatcher left his keys. Is everything okay? You look. I'm. I'm sorry, Sheriff. I have to take care of this. We'll talk later, okay? Here, seriously, where the hell is King Cole? Missing, obviously. <laughs> Good morning, Miss White. You're late. Someone's gonna see you, Colin. <laughs> <laughs> a, pig, a pig with a six pack. I know. That's where I think I already got it from. <laughs> he's a, and it's clear he's already had one because of how he's. <laughs> uh, they're out in broad daylight. Yeah. Oh, Gowan! Jesus! We only have like five minutes. They carry me for fuck's sake! I don't give a shit! You forgot these. Oh, thank you. It's uh, been pretty busy around here. Morning, mm. Sheriff. Nice fucking day. <laughs> <laughs> 